Our story begins in 1926 with John Grierson as a college student in Chicago. He reviewed a film called Nanook of the North and coined the term documentary. In 1930, Grierson returned back home to England with hopes to leverage the educational power of the documentary aesthetic. He ended up leading something called the British Documentary Movement. Meanwhile in Canada, the Canadian Government Motion Picture Bureau was the sole producer of films in Canada, and after 1931, the CGMPB began to decline in output and quality, creating travelogues that misrepresented the lives of Canadians. In addition, American films were dominating Canadian cinemas. So in 1936, it was recommended that a study of Canadian promotional films be led by John Grierson. Two years later, John Grierson arrived in Canada and after a month, finished his report, which outlined a centralized policy to produce films, including documentaries, to promote Canada abroad and nurture national unity. In May of 1939, the National Film Board was created with a vision to help Canadians from coast to coast grasp a better understanding of each other's problems and ways of life. The NFB was instrumental in defining a Canadian identity through film and documentary, and without the help of John Grierson, would not have been possible. 